Ray Ray here, Fabulous Bulldogs, checking in with you guys today. Hope everybody's having a great day. Hope everybody's being safe out there. Just enjoying this beautiful morning outside with the Bulldogs, letting them get some exercise. There goes Raven and Chanel. I mean, Bella and Chanel, excuse me. <laughs> but there goes Raven right there. Got Raven over there. Got all three of the girls out today. Enjoying herself, getting a little exercise outside. Um, not doing anything too spectacular, you guys. I think my girl Bella is coming back in heat. She looks like she's swelling up. So I'm keeping a close eye on her right now. Hopefully, she is coming back in heat, you guys. Show you. If you guys can see her back in. She looks like she's swelling up a little bit. So... I'm keeping a close eye on her. Got the other dogs around her as well. Because one thing about um, female dogs, when one dog comes in the heat, if you keep the other dogs around them, that will also bring them in the heat as well. So got all the dogs around her right now. So if she comes in the heat, hopefully the rest of them will come in the heat as well by her being in heat. Chanel, what are you doing? But... Yeah, so I'm keeping a close eye on her. Hopefully she is coming in to heat, you guys. Taking her back to Solomon again. It's just going to be a repeat because she didn't take the last time. <laughs> but got all the girls outside. Got them all outside and enjoying themselves. Bella, mama, you tired? Chanel, she's hyperactive, running around. She's always giving Bella a hard time. Hey, mama. But yeah, you guys, just out here with the bulldogs, letting them get some exercise, letting them enjoy themselves, let them play, get out some of that energy. It's starting to cool off out here in Phoenix, Arizona, which is a good thing. Look at Chanel. She's always bum rushing her. <laughs> but Bella's so calm and patient with her. She don't even care. But Raven, reason I keep Raven in there, she's still, she's still young and rambunctious, so she likes to run around and bite and nibble at him all day, and it really gets him frustrated. So I just keep her in there so that way it's less work because I constantly have to tell her stop, and the other dogs just don't get to enjoy themselves. What up, Chanel? What are you doing, little bitty girl? What are you doing? But, yeah, like I said, you guys, I got them all outside enjoying themselves. Gonna be keeping them around Bella for a while. Cause if she's in heat right now, by her being around all the other girls, it'll bring them in the heat just like human beings, you know, with their with their periods and cycles. Um, if females are around each other, they normally get on the same, the same cycle. So that's the same with dogs as well. So hopefully Bella can bring them all in the heat again. And we'll see what we can do. Raven's already 11 months old. 11 months, just turned 11 months. So, I don't think she'll be coming in anytime soon. This will be her second. She came in already about eight months. So, I don't think it's gonna, she's not coming in anytime soon, but we're waiting on Chanel right there. She should be sometime soon. And if Bella, is in heat, normally it'll bring her in heat because she came in really late. She came into her heat about 11 months, almost 12 months. It took her a while to come in the heat. All these dogs is different, you guys. They're all different. They come in. Bella, she came in at eight months. Raven came in at eight months. But Chanel, she didn't come in until she was almost a year old. So they're all different, you guys. If you got bulldogs and they're not coming in the heat, some of them come in early, some of them come in late. They all depend. They're all different. Just like human beings, they're all different. They love each other. Look at them. <laughs> but yeah, you guys, I want to thank everybody who's been subscribing to my YouTube channel. Like I mentioned earlier, we're not doing anything too spectacular. Just out here enjoying the beautiful day with the dogs. Let them get out. Let them get some exercise, you guys. Thank you guys for subscribing to my channel. I really, really, really appreciate every single one of you guys and everybody who hits me up on my Instagram telling me how, how much my videos have helped them when they purchased their first English Bulldog. 
and that's what this channel is about you guys is to give information i don't know everything about dogs you guys i'm still learning myself but the information that i do know you guys i will share it with you because i know it's all a learning experience and every little bit helps you know Find somebody that you guys may know if you own English Bulldogs. Find somebody that you that knows a lot about English Bulldogs and have them mentor you. Like me, I have a mentor, somebody who teaches me a lot. And that way I'm able to pass it on to you guys. I got a friend out here. He's a breeder. He's from California. And he has taught me so much about the Bulldog breed. And that's what helps me out when my dogs get skin allergies, when, my, when things happen with my dogs like Bella. Look at her, she's constantly licking her paw, if you can see her paw right there. But I got the sore down. And Chanel's like the only dog that really doesn't have anything. She doesn't have allergies, she doesn't have anything really. Um, she just recently had a, 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 what is it called? Something wrong with her eye. and But that's all cleared up. So just gave her eye drops and things. She gets a lot of gunk by her eyes, so I constantly gotta clean it out every day. She had an ulcer in her eye. Excuse me. Yeah, that's what it was. And I had to take her to the vet. And basically, it's cleared up. She's doing wonderful because she scratches at her eyes sometimes when she gets gunk in it with her with her dew claw. And she scratched it up. But she seems like she's doing okay now. We got her back. And that's what it's about, you guys, is learning, experiences. So next time a situation occurs, I'll be prepared for it. But sometimes the situations are expensive. <laughs> Um, you have to take them to the vet. The vet will teach you, but it's going to cost you. Hey, guys. What up? 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 Bella. But, yeah, you guys, like I said, not doing anything spectacular. Just wanted to make a real quick video to show you all three of the girls together outside, having a good time, enjoying themselves today. Hope everybody's being safe out there. Go ahead and hit the like button. Hit the subscribe button and the bell notification so you can stay updated with more videos from Fabulous Bulldogs. God bless and have a good day.